Salam everyone. Welcome to this lesson about jobs and work. Today's objective is talk about jobs and vocabulary related to them. So, let's get started. Now, let's begin with some vocabulary that will help us understand this lesson better. So, we have the words ambition, planting trees, watering trees, office, shop, solving puzzles, countryside, river, and sea. Let's begin with the word ambition. In this first picture, we have the boy's ambition is to become a doctor. In this one, the male's ambition is to have a big house and a nice car. In this one, this boy's ambition is to be a businessman. And in this one, this male's ambition is to have a luxurious car. Clear? Well, Let's move to planting trees and here is a picture showing us this term. Clear? Well, now let's move to watering trees. And here you are. Okay, everyone? Let's move then. Now let's try to explain the word office office and here are two pictures showing us the word office nice move then now it's the time to explain the word shop shop and here are two pictures again showing us what is a shop okay Great. Move now to solving puzzles. Solving puzzles. And here we have people trying to solve puzzles. I think it's clear because, it, well, the best way to explain is the pictures. Okay? Well, now let's move to countryside. We all know the word city here you are in this picture and here is the countryside it's kind of the opposite of city nice the last two words are river and sea and here are two pictures showing us both terms so far so good my students Let's move. Now, my students, let's try to practice the pronunciation of these words. Number one, a surgeon, a surgeon. Number two, a salesperson. A salesperson. Number three, a fisherman. A fisherman. Four, a farmer. A farmer. Number five, an engineer. An engineer. Six, a fireman. A fireman. Seven, a mason. A mason. And number eight, a secretary, a secretary, nice. So, these words, what are they? Of course, they are jobs, jobs, good. Let's move. Here, we have to read about some students and choose a job for each one of them. We're gonna Choose from the jobs we've just seen, I mean, from exercise number 
one. Francois from France says, "My favorite subject is geography. I also like science. My hobby is planting and watering trees. I like nature. My ambition is to live in the countryside." What is the best job for Francois? Excellent, a farmer. A farmer. Number two, Mayana from Russia says, "My favorite subjects are English, French, and German. I like computer studies too. My hobby is writing letters and poems. I love my small room." My ambition is to work in an office. So, which job will you give, Mayana? Great, a secretary. A secretary. Well, let's move to Hans from Germany. Well, Hans says my favorite subject is science. I also like geography. My hobby is fishing in the sea. I like good weather and rivers. My ambition is to have a small boat. What is the job that you're gonna give hands? Great, good job again. A fisherman. A fisherman. Well, let's move to the last one. Shami from India. Shami says my favorite subject is maths. I also like languages. My hobby is solving puzzles. I love drawing too. My ambition is to have a shop and a lot of money. What is the job or the best job for Shami? Great, excellent. It's a salesperson. A salesperson. Good job. Well, let's move then. Now, my students, we have to do this job questionnaire and find a job for our partners. I did this with one of my students, and here are his answers. For number one, what's your favorite subject? The answer was science. For number two. What's your favorite hobby? The answer: reading books. Number three: What do you like doing? The answer was helping sick people. And for the last one: What's your ambition? His answer was work in a modern hospital. Okay. So, in your opinion, what is? The best job for my partner. Good, wonderful. It's a doctor. It's a doctor. Good job. Thank you. Well, as a homework, I'd like you to do this questionnaire with your friends. Okay, and have a nice day.